Hi everyone, welcome back. You are watching the Data Labs. My name is Dilip. In this video, we are going to see the demo of Sales Executive Dashboard that has been developed in Power BI. So let's move to the Power BI uh, window. And here you can see that we are in Power BI window. And in this Power BI window, I have developed this Sales Executive Dashboard. So in this dashboard, if you look at this, we have three different uh, you know, pages like Dashboard, Sales Summary, that is the second one and that is a country tooltip basically okay so let's move to the dashboard first and see what features we have added over here so uh, in this dashboard if you look at this on top i have placed a uh, beautiful you know headers sales executive dashboard uh, including like we have some slices like product sales manager country and the date filter here so with the help of product sales uh, manager country and date filter you can slice and dice the data based on different category and different time duration okay below that we have uh, some uh, tiles basically like uh, if you look at this cards like transaction quantity sold sales uh, in million average basket value total profit and profit percentage so with the help of all these tiles we are showing the uh, no, key performance like the kpi value like it's showing overall transactions quantity sold and all this now uh, below that uh, we have a dynamic like you now we have four different charts over here like one is the line chart which is showing the transaction uh, by date basically like it's a date and again uh, this KPI value that is a transaction by product so this donor chart is showing this product uh, name performance like how it's performing against this transaction like the KPI basically right and then we have a column, a column chart here it's a, it's a sales manager column chart and that is showing the sales manager wise transaction value now the fourth uh, visualization is you know the map visualization which is showing uh, the country wise performance uh, this transaction performance and if you look at this uh, this arrow indicator is showing uh, which is uh, which is showing that okay all these visuals are currently showing the data for transaction only not this uh, other kpi it means uh, all these cards like it's a transaction quantity sold sales on million average basket value total profit million and profits so all these uh, metrics are dynamic it means if you want to see the performance of any of the kpi you just need to click on this uh, any of the card and it will start showing so let me show you like i am pressing the control because uh, we are in uh, power bi development uh, power bi desktop window so let's uh, i'm click uh, selecting this uh, no like holding this control key and then clicking on this quantity sold so once I will click on quantity sold, if you look at this, the arrow has moved from this transaction to quantity sold. And now all these cards, like, you know, even like earlier it was showing the transaction uh, by a date. Now it has started showing the quantity sold by date, quantity sold by product name. So this is how we can dynamically change the performance. And with the help of one page, like having one page, uh, we can switch to different metrics. Like say, suppose we just need to see the performance of sales, like how sales is performing on the different category or different you know dimension basically we can see that similarly like average basket value uh, total profits and profit percentage so that's how we can uh, we can move from one kpi to different kpi okay and again we have a slicer here so that we can control and we can slice and dice the data for a specific uh, you know dimension now in addition to that like you know uh, i we have a drill through feature uh, basically so sales summary the second uh, page that is especially for sales summary uh, especially like you know this is for drill through page it means if you'll go to the dashboard page and right click on any of this chart right like i'm clicking on like this one right click now you can see that uh, you can drill through from uh, sales manager to sales summary basically so it means if i will drill through from this this particular gen day do it to sales summary it will jump to this uh, sales summary and it will select this sales manager name like we are coming from this sales manager that's why this filter has been applied okay with the help of this button this back button we can go to the back and again we can jump to this so this is the uh, drill through features and that is available on each and every uh, you know uh, charts now in addition to drill through features we have also a tooltip like if you look at this it's a tooltip i have created that is for country performance basis on the kpi selection so let me move to the dashboard here and now uh, let's uh, hover uh, over our mouse cursor here now if you look at this like 
I have uh, my mouse cursor is on Gen, so Gen Do performance is 28.38. So how this sales manager is performing on uh, in different country, basically like Canada, New Zealand, UK, USA, and Australia. So you can see the performance by country. Again, similarly, if you put your mouse on this uh, different, you know, uh, salesman, you can see the performance of that particular salesman by country, basically how this salesman is performing in different different country. Okay, if you want to look at this performance, like uh, say suppose like I'm checking this uh, this product A, so how product is A is performing in different countries. So this is how we can uh, see the performance. Okay, if you want to see the performance of this country, so this is the USA and the performance is 26.97. Okay, so this all these basic features we have covered here, and this this dashboard is fully dynamic. It's interactive. It means. You do not need to apply, you know, filter on this this slicer only. You can click on any of this category, like you know, uh, chart basically. Like, say, suppose I want to see the performance of uh, this this salesman. Just click on that, and it will filter the data for this uh, this salesman only. Even even all these cards values started showing the performance of this Jane Doe. Okay. Similarly, if you want to see the performance of this product A, so you just need to click on product A, and it will start showing the performance of product A only. So it it means we do not need to go and uh, you know slice or dice the data using this uh, this slicer only. So you are free to use either you can go with this or you can select any of this uh, you know a category like whether it's a product name or maybe sales manager name or maybe a country name like this way. Okay. So hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye bye.